To start the egg laying sulfur, mash the barb on a size 14 dry fly hook and place it in the vise. I'm using an HMH standard vise. Start your thread a bit back from the eye and run a base of thread the length of the hook shank and trim the tag. Run the thread back to within a sixteenth of an inch from the eye. Next we're going to clip a pinch of hair from the bottom of a snowshoe hare's foot. Comb out the underfur and stack it to align the tips. Remove any stray fibers, then measure and position the hair in the wing position. Using the pinch method, tie in the hair by making a full revolution before tightening the thread. This helps to keep the hair on top of the hook. After it's secure, trim the butt ends at an angle and then complete the wraps to cover the butt ends. Take the thread to the back of the shank. Now apply your dubbing mix for the egg ball onto the thread. When forming the egg ball, try to keep the wraps on top of each other by using an X pattern. Use your free hand to hold the last rotation in place if needed. Think of a rubber band ball. You might have to wrap it at all angles. You want to try to have it look round if at all possible. Next, we're going to tie in three mayfly tails and split them to look like a spinner or an egg layer. You want the length to be about one and a half to two times the length of the mayfly body. After the tails are secured, trim the excess. Now tie in the ribbing thread. After the rib is in place, dub your thread for the abdomen and thorax. 
and then dub creating a taper toward the wing. Once the abdomen and the back half of the thorax is formed, use hackle pliers to spin the ribbing thread so that it stays round on the fly. Then wrap for a segmented effect. Add more dubbing mix. Now pull back the wing and dub tightly directly in front of it. This will prop up the wing in the proper position and complete the thorax. Whip finish and cement. Then gently tug the wings to the sides for the desired effect. If you want the fly to lay deeper in the film, you can pull the wings up or leave them up. If you want the fly to ride higher, you can pull the wings down farther. This completes the egg-laying sulfur.